This is an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar presenting advanced color techniques in Adobe Premiere Pro. Hi, my name is Larry Jordan. In this short video tutorial, I'll show you how to use the hue saturation curves to change the colors of a portion of an image. For example, to change the color of a shirt. What hue saturation curves allow me to do is to select a color or a range of colors and do something to it. For instance, here with the woman with the red dress, you've seen this a lot because it's just such a treat to play with. We're going to go down to, we're going to go down to curves and under curves, we're going to hue saturation curves. This allows me to change hue versus saturation, set a color and change the saturation for the color. Click the eyedropper tool. I'm going to click on her red dress, which sets a range for the red. If I take that red dress and pull it all the way down, notice that now her dress has gone gray, but the rest of the shot remains in color. Or, putting this back again, right to there, if I take this and pull it down, and take this and pull it down. Everything is black and white except the red dress. And how many movies have we seen the girl in the red dress and everything else is black and white? Yeah, Matrix, and we've seen it with uh, uh, Schindler's List and Traveler's Umbrellas. Or what I can do is I can open this up right about here and right about here. And notice that the red dress and the pure retain the color and the sky has gone black and white or the opposite. So I am making the pier and the dress black and white, but retaining the blue sky. Or here in this shot, I want to change the color of her shirt. So I'm going to select this color and there's our color right there. Go to Effect Controls, and under Lumetri, I'm going to set a mask that just has her shirt. Make this smaller so I can see what I'm doing. Because her lipstick is the same color as her shirt, and now we'll go back to Fit. And I want to take the shirt and we'll make it, make it a bit green. Now let's make it orange and open this up to get more of the color. Open this up to get more of the color. There we go. I don't want to change your skin. So I got to be careful with that. And then the other thing I want to do is I also want to change saturation just a bit. So we'll click here. This samples the color and I'll just decrease the saturation a bit so it's not quite as intense. I don't want it to go black and white. Let's just be a little less intense. And the nice thing now is is that the color change exists across the entire shot but only for the shirt. Everything else remains the same. The hue saturation curves allow me to Select a color and change its saturation. Select a color and change its color. Select a color and change its brightness. Select brightness and change saturation. Select saturation and change saturation. All very, very cool stuff. This was an excerpt of a recent Power Up webinar presenting advanced color techniques in Adobe Premiere Pro. For the complete version of this online training, please visit my store at larryjordan.com slash store and look for Webinar 311. By the way, when you need to stretch your training dollars, membership in our video training library saves you money and time. You can access all our videos for a low monthly price of only $19.99. That's almost two thousand movies, hundreds of hours on a wide variety of subjects. Plus, premium members can download practice media and projects. Our training covers Apple and Adobe software. We update it multiple times each month. And for more information, visit LarryJordan.com slash membership. 
and thanks.